Well, we are also following breaking news in the crisis unfolding in Afghanistan. While you were sleeping, multiple rockets were fired toward Kabul's International Airport. This, as time is ticking, there are just hours left in one of the largest airlift evacuations in history. The final flights are arriving and departing as we speak. Chris Hoffman is monitoring the situation this morning and joins us live. Chris, what do we know at this hour? Brianna and David, according to U.S. officials, as many as five rockets were fired toward the airport there. Now, the defenses at the airport did intercept those rockets, and at this point, there are no reports of any casualties. CNN reports that apparently a civilian vehicle was used to launch these rockets toward the airport. It's not known who fired them, but there is belief this was from ISIS-K. This all comes as evacuations continue in Afghanistan ahead of tomorrow's deadline. Now, there has been internal and international pressure to extend that deadline, but right now the Biden administration still plans to finish their operations in the country tomorrow. We have the capacity to have 300 Americans, which is roughly the number we think are remaining, come to the airport and get on planes in the time that is remaining. The White House says about 114,000 people have been evacuated so far from Afghanistan. The president has been briefed about this rocket attack. Now, as this story continues to develop, look for updates both on air here as well as online. Live this morning, Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.